The Grahamsville Little World's Fair is opening this weekend and it has been a tradition for 143 years. Thousands of people from surrounding areas go to Grahamsville to enjoy the many festivities. Jessica Doyle is the general superintendent and she talked about what people can expect when they get there. We have a two hour long sensory friendly time for the rides where there'll be no lights, no um, music, it'll just be quiet. Um, the entire fairgrounds kind of stays quiet so that those kids can enjoy the entire fair for two hours without anything overstimulating them. Live music all weekend from a lot of local artists and um, of course the rides and really, really, really good food. Frank Cuff, the owner of Frankie's French Fries, usually has lines outside of his stand waiting for those freshly made fries. Besides fries, Frank has something else to offer. The fair has a scholarship fund, and when my wife died in 2000, we put a $500 scholarship in her name. And it doesn't have to be somebody that's a rocket scientist. I like people that work and dedicate to the fair. And this is who our scholarship, the Entre Teresa Cuff Entrepreneur Scholarship, is uh, dedicated to. Mike Garigliano is the director of the fair. We have one vendor who says that uh, it's a fair on a hill, but we're on the level. And uh, so we, we pride ourselves on being a traditional little country fair. I'm Jim Sebastian, MidHudsonNews.com.